Welcome back to the High Sierra Airport. I'm joined by my very special guest and brother, Chris Lorisella, in the studio. And he's wearing his helmet, which he always does on the hill. He um, wears his helmet for safety, right, Chris? And you look good, right? Mm. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> and um, so it's really important that people like Chris can get out on the hill and enjoy themselves. And not only do they have a great adaptive program for kids with special needs and adults with special needs, but they also have a great program for people with disabilities. So let's take a look at Amy Prudy and her story. My name is Amy Prudy and I'm 32 years old. At the age of 19, I contracted something called bacterial meningitis, which resulted in me losing both of my legs below the knees. And prior to this, I was a competitive snowboarder. So being 19 and losing my legs, I had no idea if I was going to be able to do what I'd love to do again. And got back into it about seven months after I lost my legs, started competing again. This last year, I competed in four World Cups. I won three out of the four. And uh, that makes me now the top female snowboarder in the world right now. What I love about snowboarding is how carefree you feel when you're carving down a mountain of powder, how independent it is because you pretty much make your own rules. You do whatever you want to do. You can get so creative with it. You decide, say I'm going to try this and nose slide a, a rail or you know, do a somersault. I mean, there's so much fun different things that you can do with snowboarding. And there's so much different terrain. You can ride trees. You can ride the lift. You can ride powder. You can go cat skiing, hard skiing. There's just so much amazing stuff you can do. And for me, it just feels so good to just be So there's a, a short look at her inspiring story. You can see more of her story online. And we'll be back with Chris and more of the High Sierra Report after this.